The other day, as I was walking in the woods, my eye was caught by something sitting on the forest floor. It was the delicate nest of a small bird called a black-throated green warbler. Black-throated green warblers always nest in trees, so this nest must have been knocked down by the wind, or maybe by a predator such as a squirrel or blue jay. The parrot birds would never use this nest again, so here was an opportunity to find out exactly how they construct their nests. Just like in human houses, the materials birds use have to provide a solid structure to hold their young, plus insulation to keep them warm. But unlike our homes, their nests need to be hidden from predators. So I think I'll dissect the whole thing, see what we can find. It turns out that, like most songbirds, black-throated green warblers actually build two nests, one nestled within the other. The materials they use differ between the outer and inner nests. The outer nest is made up of birch bark, rootlets, twigs and mosses, so it's strong and camouflaged. The inner nest is lined with the feathers of other birds, stems of red maple flowers, fuzz collected from cinnamon ferns, fine hemlock twigs, and pine needles. Imagine finding the 15 or so different materials you'd need to build a nest and doing it for the very first time with no instruction or practice. 